The Adaptations of Elephants for Survival. Welcome to our video on elephant adaptation. Elephants are one of the most magnificent and fascinating creatures on our planet. These gentle giants have evolved many unique adaptations to survive in the natural habitats, which range from harsh deserts to dense tropical rainforests. In this video, we will explore the remarkable adaptations of elephants, including their physical features, social behaviors, and dietary habits. Please don't forget to subscribe to my channel and like this video. By the end of this video, you will have a deeper understanding and appreciation of these amazing animals and their incredible abilities to adapt and thrive in their environments. So, let's get started and dive into the world of elephant adaptation. Elephants are the largest existing land animals. Three living species are currently recognized, the African bush elephant, the African forest elephant, and the Asian elephant. They are the only surviving members of the family Elephantidae and the order Proboscidae. Elephants are classified into two species, African elephants Loxodonta africana and Asian elephants Elephas maximus. They both live in hot, hostile settings with intermittent droughts and plenty of predators to harm prey species, yet their adaptations have allowed them to thrive. Distribution The elephant species can be found in Southeast Asia, South Asia, and Sub-Saharan Africa. African forest elephants live in Africa's central and western regions, while African bush elephants live in the east and south. What kinds of habitats do they inhabit? African bush elephants can be found in a variety of habitats, including dry savannas, marshes, lakeshores, and deserts. They've also been spotted at altitudes of 8,000 feet. Forest elephants can be found in equatorial forests, ecotones areas where savannas and forests meet and gallery forests. Asian elephants, on the other hand, enjoy habitats that include a variety of low woody plants, trees, and grasses. List of common types of elephant species. Elephantidae consists of only two surviving genera Elephas and Loxodonta, while the now extinct genera include Mammothus, Crimelophus, and Paleoloxodon. The Loxodonta includes the following two living species. African bush elephant. African forest elephant. The other genus Elephas consists of the Asian elephant that is classified into four living subspecies. Indian elephant. Borneo elephant or Borneo pygmy elephant. Sumatran elephant. Sri Lankan elephant. Elephants from Africa versus Asian elephants. African elephants have longer ears that extend all the way to their necks whereas Asian elephants have smaller, round ears. African elephants have rounder heads, but Asian elephants have twin-domed heads. Both male and female Africans can develop tusks, but only male Asians do. Size The vast size of elephants is an excellent anti-predator adaptation. Although they are officially prey animals rather than predators, adults are so huge that they are immune to wild animal attacks. Humans are the only predators that can pose a threat. Baby elephants, on the other hand, can be attacked and killed by predators such as lions, tigers, and hyenas. To prevent calves from being damaged, adults in a herd will gather the young and form a protective circle around them. Trunk. A trunk is an immensely helpful feature of the anatomy of a huge creature with a short neck. It not only allows elephants to reach food high up in branches, but it also allows them to obtain food and water on the ground that they would otherwise be unable to reach. They also use their trunks to communicate with one another and warn their herd of any potential threats by making calls and other sounds. Tusks Although elephants' tusks might cause problems because they are mostly poached for their ivory, they are also incredibly useful. They use them to remove the bark and soft wood from trees, which they then devour. Their tusks can also assist them in surviving dry spells. They use them to drill into the ground and find water in dry riverbeds. They also use them to dig in the ground and find salts and other minerals that are essential to their meals. Tusks. These are modified incisors located in the upper jaw, replacing milk teeth at about 6 to 12 months of age and growing continuously at 7 in 17 centimeters per year. The smooth enamel cap of a newly formed tusk ultimately wears off. Teeth. They have 26 teeth, including 12 deciduous premolars, 
12 molars, and the incisors or tusks. Their old chewing teeth are usually replaced by new ones, six times throughout their lives. Elephants live in hot climates and require the ability to cool themselves. They've come up with another solution because they can't sweat. Their ear flaps include numerous blood capillaries, which aid in the release of surplus heat into the surrounding environment. African bush elephants have huge ear flaps and live in some of the world's hottest areas. This procedure has the potential to reduce their blood temperature by more than 10 degrees Fahrenheit. Despite the fact that Asian elephants have smaller ears than African elephants, the technique is just as successful. Their skull has many air chambers that help to reduce the weight of the skull while maintaining overall strength. The inside of their skull resembles a honeycomb due to numerous cavities. The trunk, or proboscis, allows them to twist and coil, allowing them to lift greater weights and battle other elephants. It is also used for delicate activities such as inspecting an opening, cracking a peanut, or wiping an eye. Their tusks help them defend and protect themselves in addition to digging for salt and water, moving branches, and debarking trees. Elephants have vertically positioned limbs that help in supporting their weight. The position of their leg bones also helps them in standing still for a long time without using much energy. What is the weight of an elephant? The two elephant species, African and Asian, share many characteristics, including one, big, one, they're both enormous. In fact, the African elephant is the largest land animal on the globe. While elephants are born with a good head start in terms of size, they have to work hard to maintain their astounding size, if you consider virtually constant eating to be effort. Large and heavy. While African elephants are slightly larger than Asian elephants, both are extremely enormous. Female mature African elephants can weigh anywhere from 5,000 to 7,000 pounds, while males reach between 10,000 and 13,500 pounds. Asian elephants weigh approximately 1,000 pounds less than African elephants. Female Asians can grow to be 7 feet tall at the shoulder, while men can grow to be 9 feet tall. Africans may reach heights of 8 to 13 feet at the shoulder, and the powerful trunks allow them to reach even higher. Because African elephants are so large, few predators attack them. They are only vulnerable to predators like crocodiles and lions when they are infants. Elephants despite the terrifying adult size, are not without foes. African elephants is a threatened species historically poached for its ivory tusks. They're stuffing their faces. Of course, elephants have a voracious appetite, so they spend a lot of time eating. They spend 16 to 18 hours per day foraging and feeding, consuming 300 to 375 pounds of food per day to support their herbivore diets. They devour grass, plants, fruit, bushes, and whatever else their trunks can wrap around. They, of course, wash it all down with plenty of water. An elephant consumes 18 to 40 gallons of water per day, depending on size and season, a very large and thirsty adult male might consume 55 gallons in just a few minutes. Large babies, female elephants give birth to infants weighing up to 200 pounds after approximately 22 months of gestation. Female elephants normally do not become pregnant more than once every few years due to the duration of the pregnancy and the delivery of a truly big kid. The dirty diet. Elephants have particular nutritional needs that they meet in unexpected ways, such as eating dirt, due to their size. Elephants use their tusks to scrape up dirt, which they then eat for precious minerals and salt. They also use their trunks to scrape the bark off trees which is healthy for the digestive tracts and provides calcium for robust teeth and bones. What changes help elephants stay cool? Elephants, the largest terrestrial creatures on Earth, rely on additional physical and behavioral adaptations to keep their gigantic bodies from overheating in the absence of sweat gland. Cooling mechanisms are especially important in African savanna elephants, the most corpulent of the three living elephant species, and hence more obvious. They have to deal with hotter, drier weather than the African forest elephant and the endangered Asian elephant that lives in the jungle. Ears The major cooling mechanism of an elephant is a pair of prominent ears that account for one-sixth of the animal's body size. 
The African savanna variety can grow to be up to 13 feet tall at the shoulder, resulting in extraordinarily huge ears. Elephants may drop their body temperature by 10 degrees Fahrenheit or more by simply flapping their ears. Air permeates the elephant's ear's thin skin, chilling blood as it flows through a network of capillaries inside the ears before returning to the body. Elephants frequently open their ears and face the wind to increase the effect. African savanna elephants have the largest ears, which are shaped like their home continent, followed by African forest elephants and Asian elephants. What changes help elephants stay cool? Elephants, the largest terrestrial creatures on Earth, rely on additional physical and behavioral adaptations to keep their gigantic bodies from overheating in the absence of sweat glands. Cooling mechanisms are especially important in African savanna elephants, the most corpulent of the three living elephant species, and hence more obvious. They have to deal with hotter, drier weather than the African forest elephant and the endangered Asian elephant that lives in the jungle. Ears The major cooling mechanism of an elephant is a pair of prominent ears that account for one-sixth of the animal's body size. The African savanna variety can grow to be up to 13 feet tall at the shoulder, resulting in extraordinarily huge ears. Elephants may drop their body temperature by 10 degrees Fahrenheit or more by simply flapping their ears. Air permeates the elephant's ear's thin skin, chilling blood as it flows through a network of capillaries inside the ears before returning to the body. Elephants frequently open their ears and face the wind to increase the effect. African savanna elephants have the largest ears, which are shaped like their home continent, followed by African forest elephants and Asian elephants. Skin. The wrinkles in an elephant's essentially hairless skin help keep the animal cool by providing a bigger surface area for heat to escape through. The wrinkles and pleats of an elephant's hide catch and keep moisture longer than smooth skin, extending the evaporation process and allowing the animal to release up to 75% of her body heat. Because African elephants live in areas where temperatures can reach 120 degrees Fahrenheit during the day, the skin is substantially more wrinkled than that of their Asian relatives. Bathing. When the heat of the day becomes unbearable, elephants love submerging their bodies in water and showering, which involves sucking water with their flexible, muscular trunks and then spraying themselves. Bathing not only helps elephants clear their thick skin of parasites, but it also helps these massive creatures lower their body temperature. The cooling effect of a bath or shower lasts even after the elephant has left the water, because to their moisture-retaining wrinkled skin. Other modifications. Elephants are mostly crepuscular, which means they are most active around dawn and dusk, when the sun is lower in the sky and temperatures are cooler. Furthermore, an elephant can detect water sources up to 12 miles away by utilizing his trunk as a nose in conjunction with a particular gland known as the Jacobson's organ which is located to the roof of the mouth. This skill is especially important during the dry season. African Elephant Description Elephants are the world's largest land mammals. There are two elephant species left, Asian elephants and African elephants. Elephants are herbivores who prefer areas with plenty of food and water. Both species can devour up to 300 pounds of food each day. Despite obvious similarities, Asian and African elephants have significant morphological distinctions that set them apart. Size. African elephants are larger than Asian elephants, standing between 10 and 13 feet tall and weighing up to 14,000 pounds or more. Asian elephants have shoulder heights ranging from 6.5 to 11.5 feet and can weigh up to 13,000 pounds. Skin and ears. The ears are the easiest way to differentiate an Asian elephant from an African elephant. Elephants all utilize their ears to keep cool. African elephants have huge ears that stretch up over their necks, whereas Asian elephants have small, rounded ears. Their hides are also unique. Asian elephants have smooth, dark gray to brown hides with pink spots. The hides of African elephants are wrinkled and dark gray. Trunks and tusks. Asian elephants have a finger-like extension on the tips of their trunks. African elephants have two finger-like extensions on theirs. Elephants use this extension to grasp food and scoop it into their mouths. Tusks come in handy for clearing paths, debarking trees and establishing dominance. 
Female Asian elephants do not usually have tusks, and when they do they are so small they are barely visible. Many male Asian elephants lack tusks as well, but those that do have them have large ones. However, female and male African elephants have tusks. Males tend to have longer tusks than females, and they use them to fight other males over females. Eating Asian elephants are grazes, which means they eat whatever is on the ground, which is mainly grass and low vegetation. African elephants, on the other hand, are browsers, which means they eat twigs and higher level vegetation such as trees and shrubs. Human-human interaction. Humans have domesticated Asian elephants, which are utilized as beasts of burden or for transportation. They've also been utilized in battle. African elephants are not hostile, but they are much harder to domesticate. As a result, it is significantly more common to encounter Asian elephants in circuses than African elephants. What do elephants do for pleasure? Elephants are the world's largest creatures, and they like having a good time. Elephants can live for 60 to 70 years and have deep and very tight ties with their families. With such a long lifetime and tight social ties, there is plenty of time for enjoyment and togetherness. Elephants, like humans, enjoy good old-fashioned playtime. Mud baths Mud baths are a favorite pastime of elephants. They enjoy not just romping and playing with their companions in mud baths, but also the cooling sensation and respite that mud provides from the extremely high temperatures of the native Africa and Asia. Elephants in captivity enjoy mud baths as well, and may be seen giving their companions a friendly nudge and rolling around in the mud. Socializing Elephants, being extremely intelligent and gregarious animals, like socializing with one another. Elephants are frequently observed kissing one another. They like to entwine their trunks as though to say hello or provide a loving hug. Biologists believe the trunks are used to greet other elephants since they can smell through them. Water sports. Elephants like cooling off in bodies of water and may enjoy a good swim with their friends. Elephants are great swimmers, therefore they are used to being in the water. They can cool off in the water while wrestling with their companions and herd mates. Elephants' ears also help to keep their body cool in the heat. Elephants can be seen flapping their ears, which serves as a natural cooling method. Football and having fun with your friends. Elephants in captivity are frequently observed playing with supplied toys such as soccer balls and giant beach balls. They had a lot of fun swatting the ball around with their trunks. This can provide hours of entertainment. Elephant calves like running around with their friends from an early age. They begin building intimate ties that will last a lifetime literally from their calfhoods. Thank you for watching my video please don't forget to subscribe to my channel and like to this video.